Good morning, bad news. The poverty line is fake. In 2022 in the United States, the poverty threshold for a single person under 65 was an annual income of $13,590 or $1,132 a month. The median rent for a one bedroom apartment in the United States is $1,697 a month. So a person on the poverty line can't afford a single month of rent. Not to mention food, healthcare, childcare, transportation, clothing, internet, a cell phone, or literally anything else. And of course you can say, well, yeah, there are government programs designed to provide for those people below the poverty threshold. The actual number of Americans who cannot afford basic needs, which is the actual definition of poverty, is 43% of households, or about 142 million Americans. So 100 million Americans, one third of the entire country, cannot afford basic needs. And most don't have access to them through government programs because they don't fall below this fake poverty line. And the poverty line is fake because it was developed in the 1960s, based exclusively on food prices and not rent at a time when food prices were high and rent was dirt cheap. Today, while food has gotten more affordable, rent prices have skyrocketed. So why doesn't Congress reformulate the poverty line? Because if they did, it'd look like poverty skyrocketed while they were in office, and that might make them look bad. And obviously looking bad is more important if you're a bad person. But hey, thanks for watching Good Morning Bad News. I'm Sam Reich, and if you like this channel and want to help support it and get this mug or these stickers as a thank you, you can find Good Morning Bad News on Patreon. The link is in the bio.